YouTube, we're back. <laughs> Back for one more. So as you may already know, we've been downsizing in our preparations to become full-time RVers. And man, we can't come soon enough. There's just so much work involved. So over the last couple weeks here, we've been selling some really big ticket items. In this video, we're going to show you uh, what we did right, mm -hmm. what we did wrong, and what we do differently next time. So check it out. If you have done the same thing and have any good tips or ideas on how to downsize and what you did right or what you did wrong, make sure you leave a comment. What's up to you, mommy? Waxing our boat. Why are you waxing her? Because we have a guy coming to probably buy her <laughs> and we're really sad about it but it probably needs to happen <laughs> it's a really sad day today i kind of hope the guy does not buy our boat and i kind of do hope he buys the boat and it's a mixed emotion kind of morning today it's kind of sad all right well Boat is cleaned up, looking all pretty. Oh, what a beautiful boat. They're stealing our boat. People aren't supposed to buy our boat when we put an ad on there. They aren't supposed online. to sell it right away. All right, we'll let you know how it goes. What are you dancing for? Figure out for a few more few more spins before you sell her. That's good. making me not want to sell this boat. <laughs> you should just leave it at my house for a while. Well, maybe we should keep the boat. <laughs> I'll tell no. you what, 200 bucks a month you can leave it at my house. Yeah, we're having fun, we're out. This is like the one last ride I keep saying on the boat. And it's reminding me that I shouldn't sell the boat. I should keep the boat. Nobody else out either. We'll play store sell. Well, Jesse, what do you think? I think maybe you should take one more run on the surfboard. Yeah, and then we'll be good. Let's do it, man. <laughs> cool. So it's official, we just sold our boat this morning. Thank you, sir. I hope you, hope you have a lot of fun. We had a lot of fun with this boat. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed our video. And we just wanted to recap and kind of explain what went down, what could have been done differently. Mm -hmm. So for example, on the boat, uh, I think oh, one thing we did well is we use the NADA pricing to kind of substantiate our asking price. As Jesse's gonna mention, people always want a deal. And so when you can prove, hey, you are getting a deal, here's the values, it really helps your case. On the flip side, things we didn't do well. <laughs> Timing, you know, for seasonal toys, mm -hmm. like a boat, you know, spring and summer is the ideal time to sell that boat. We, you know, because of Tucker coming along, we end up having to sell the boat in the fall, you know, almost winter time. Yeah. So another mistake we had with the boat, I think because of the time of season, we should have started at a lower price. <laughs> the last mistake I think that I made was not taking the time to make the boat as nice as I could. And so the takeaway with the boat, our lessons learned were people are always looking for a good deal. Mm -hmm. Um, they also want whatever they buy to look nice. In hindsight, uh, the three and a half hours it took me to clean the carpet, to clean the outside of the boat, once I did that, the boat sold within about a week. Mm -hmm. you know, I'm selling and, her. I'm selling off Alice. Yeah? My old faithful. Oh. Uh, Had her before I even knew Jesse. 
but climbing in the back seat of a two-door car with a baby in a car seat is no fun. Yeah. <laughs> so. <laughs> Bye, friend. I think, yeah, I would have, I would have loved an SUV more. <laughs> <laughs> was, was that a hint for your, her next car? <laughs> 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 no, it is tough with the baby, trying to get a baby in and out of that thing. Yeah, I did it once. I went grocery shopping. Mm -hmm. Good grief. <laughs> Not again. Here's Jenny and Nick making things official. <laughs> <laughs>